I am now at my HRuby programs prompt. What I want to do is make a program and then run it from this command line prompt. All right, I'm going to need Notepad for this. Let me put that in there. Then I'm going to take a variable called x. And then starting right from here, I'm going to channel a lot of text into x, starting from here. So I'm going to put in the word yogi. That's the Korean word for here, starting here. I'm going to key in the following. They were the best of times. They were the worst of times. I'm going to end this portion of text that I'm sending, I'm channeling into X by putting in the same word again, right here. So I'm delimit, I am marking, demarcating the beginning and the end of this section of text that I am channeling into X. And then what I want to do is print X. There's my program. I'm going to save this now. And here we go. Oops. Let me save this and bring this back. All right, there we go. And I've saved it already. File. Save. I called it poetry.rb. I'll show you again. File. Save as. And I saved it into Ruby programs. And that's it right there, poetry.rb. And let's see if we can fit this in here. There it is, poetry.rb. All files, poetry.rb, and save. Okay, so it's done. File save. And now what we want to do is run this program. So let's do it. I key in poetry, just so you can see, dir, everything with an rb extension. And there's our guy, poetry.rb. If I key in, type poetry.rb, you can see all of it right here. X equals two chevrons, yogi. They were the best of times. They were the worst of times, yogi. This begins, this marks the beginning and end of the text that's being rechanneled or channeled into the variable X. Then I print out the variable X. That looks good. Let me clear off the screen. Then I'm just going to execute this program. Huh. Poetry.rb. Let's see what happens. And bingo. It prints it all out. What do you know? That is just amazing. And what does that uh, text look like again? What does that program look like again? X equals on the two-channel chevrons. This is channeling everything starting from here, ending here. All of this text is channeled into the variable X. And then I print out whatever is in the variable X. And that's our program. That's all I want to talk about today. This is George Bull saying bye-bye.